Hi guys. So, um, headlines, uh, I invested uh, 10 million NXT and 300 BTC uh, in um, cell 411. Um, uh, so, yeah, uh, why did I do that? Um, initially, I, uh, I planned to invest less, but then um, the founder, Virgil, he, he was okay with getting paid in cryptocurrency uh, fully. And, um, and so that uh, allowed me to also pay in NXT. We already had an agreement to pay in half in Bitcoin, half in uh, US dollars, but, um, but uh, he was open to uh, actually accept NXT instead of US dollars. And for me, that, um, that was very interesting because my exposure to NXT is a little too high for comfort. That means I'm selling some NXT right now eh, by paying in NXT to him. But um, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, I don't know. I became I became more bearish on NXT in general. I still am heavily invested in NXT, so it's not like I'm uh, leaving. But. I realize, or the way I look at it is that I need to become very active in NXT to basically save the project because the way it's going, it's not going well. Um, I have uh, strong opinions on that, um, but um, yeah, I think there is something seriously wrong in NXT and I think it's first and foremost um, and this is very critical and I'm really sorry about it, but I think it's the problem, that's the what John luc is producing, it's not good enough, um, he's making too many mistakes um, and it's just not good enough. Uh, it, the end result for every new uh, update should be that you have more users and this is not the case, it's, it's not more and that's um, if first and foremost his responsibility, um, you know. And it's also the responsibility of marketing, um, and that's me uh, and people like uh, Damlo, uh, Bas, and Dave. Uh, <clears throat> but it's basically the whole NXT community. Um, we're not doing a good enough job at all, uh, and uh, and so NXT has some uh, some unique things, but we're losing really like very few people promote that. And fewer and fewer people are promoting that. And so um, I'm planning to give it uh, my all, but something really needs to change here. We cannot continue the same path as before. And so the way it has been going, creating new, big, new features or changes that first of all, like push away existing users that's only worth it if your new version is much better and attracts Netto a lot more new users. And so you need an excellent release. Eh? That means it works. That's never been the problem. It always has worked with NXT, but it also needs to be user-friendly. I think that's really lacking uh, in NXT. Every new feature is not user-friendly enough. And that's every new feature since the asset exchange the monetary system was not user-friendly enough. If I would have known that every transaction needs to be paid with NXT, I would from the start have said, but that's not possible. But it's only months later because I also didn't do a good job. Then I discovered, huh, does it work like that? Oops. Uh, marketplace, eh? uh, great. Like it's such a big, uh, everybody's looking forward to see that released, but then when it's released, you don't even have a reputation system. Like a marketplace cannot work like that. So it's just doomed from the start. And shuffling, as I mentioned in the other video, um, no, if you have to meet people to shuffle coins, that's not user friendly enough. You just need to, like when you make a payment, then you have to like be able to choose whether you send it shuffled or not. That's user friendly enough. And, and then it will be a success and it will attract more users to NXT, but otherwise it will all have been for nothing. And that's what's been happening at NXT now for two years. Things are being released and uh, 
I like there has been a lot of fights. Uh, uh, backwards compatibility was not respected enough by Jean-Luc. I think this can be forgiven um, if like the net result is positive, but it is not. Um, so sometimes you do have to like clean up shop, and 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 you do want to kick out code and, but the end, but but it needs to be absolutely worth it. Eh? You have to see improvement later on, and that's the problem that's lacking. But I think Jean Luc really uh, like doesn't have the right priorities, and that's a big problem. Um, he does very good work. But he thinks like a programmer and not as a businessman or as a um, as a visionary. He doesn't think from the perspective of the user. He thinks from the perspective of an engineer, of a programmer. And so he thinks about things like security and scalability and, 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 and code quality, all these things, and that's very important, but that comes after um, user friendliness and not before. So first it needs to be user friendly and then it needs to be secure. Not first secure and then user friendly. Because if it's not, if it's only secure, you don't have users. But if it's only user friendly, you do have users. And so that needs to be first and foremost. And so I think he made some really big mistakes um, forcing people to use a public key in addition to an NXT address. Eh? So you, you had to give not only your NXT address when you had a new account, but also you had to give your public key suddenly. Eh? And that was something he pushed through, even though the community objected strongly. That has set us back very big eh? because all existing wallets, and at the time, that's two years ago, we had a lot of wallets were broken um, and uh, and um, we lost uh, some and some are still today broken due to that. Even though he cancelled that a couple of months later, the damage was done in breaking momentum of adoption. And, and um, yeah, uh, but, but that to me, like it shows that he's not, like that's a mistake you cannot make. That's just such a big mistake. So, 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 but the problem is he is the leader and he does do quality work on other fronts. Like I, I do see it is possible that with NXT 2.0, he creates something that's better and that allows you to launch your currency uh, with the child chains. And I, I, it's possible that it works out but um, uh, so so I think I I I I, I think I, I don't know actually what to do. Um, but um, yeah, um, I, I think ideally we would like work start working together because that's not even happening. I'm just like giving my opinion, investing, and uh, uh, that's it. But um, I'm doing some marketing, but there is no communication. And uh, But I have also not reached out to him. It's a little bit strange too. But um, yeah, and marketing, you know, I just, I'm missing like people that I see do great work. There used to be a lot more people that do great work than today. I see that Damalon and Bas and Dave, they do work with NXT Foundation. But for me, like I don't believe that will um, bring value to my NXT coins. Uh, I don't see it. I could be wrong and I would hope I am proven wrong because at least they do something and like Fewer and fewer people just do something for NXT. Eh? Uh, so, 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 I mean, it's better we have them, I think, than no one. So, but um, I think I really have to like do something because the way it's going, 
I think I made a big mistake by looking at NXT as an asset instead of a, basically a startup company. And, 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 and there is a big difference. An asset class, it will never go down to zero, but a startup will go down to zero. And I've thought in the past that, okay, it's normal in a bear market that, that you get, um, that you get, yeah, I mean, a loss in amount of transactions, a loss in amount of users. I mean, Bitcoin had all of that too. So there's certainly like something to be said for that. But how is it possible that these other cryptocurrencies that also had a strong bear market, like jump up so strongly while NXT doesn't do that? That's for me the new kit on the block the past three, two months since the start of the year 2016. This has been happening. Ethereum going to a billion, but also things like NEM, um, who were like valued a lot less and started originally from the NXT community are now valued more as NXT. Uh, IOTA, eh, uh, the founder of NXT, come from beyond, and Dave, and, uh, someone who did uh, also. Uh, um, had also a central role in NXT a year ago. They also left the community, as did so many others. And um, but they started a new coin, IOTA, and they seem to be doing really good. Um, and a lot of other projects like NXT is just dropping in the coin market cap, while a lot of newcomers are just going up. So, so, so what's happening here? Is it just the market being wrong? Or is there like something seriously wrong with NXT? And I think uh, it's both. I don't think it's just the market that is wrong. I think that's part of it too. But I also think there's something wrong with NXT and that's for me new. Um, so, so, so yeah, um, that's why I sold 10 million NXT. But it's also part of, of, of um, like me becoming more active with NXT, I've just been like investing it and keeping the coins uh, in the hope for them to go up. But um, I, I need to become much more active with NXT and also like start really using the currency. And that's also part of it. It's comparable to Bitcoin. Um, like if people just buy Bitcoin and sit on Bitcoin, it's not going to happen. People need to start spending it. And so the first transactions when somebody bought a pizza for a billion Bitcoins, um, I mean, it's not that someone is just liquidating their Bitcoins. It's also that someone is just really trying to get it um, circulated. And of course, he loses a lot of Bitcoins with that. But, um, but if it works out, then, then his other Bitcoins will go up in value. And that's the case for me. I have um, like uh, still a lot of uh, invested in NXT. And, and, and for me, this is part of like uh, making something happen with NXT too. And, um, and, uh, and, and um, yeah, giving, I, I think NXT, I'm, I'm thinking about the asset exchange, of course. I, I really want to find a way to have quality companies launch on the asset exchange. I don't know how, there's a lot of regulation. If, if somebody wants to work with me on that, please contact me. Um, but um, I really wanna, wanna, wanna make something happen there. And I think, I mean, for me, it's okay. The project continues the, the way it does and that Jean-Luc continues to take the lead and, 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 and produces NXT 2.0 because I think there's an opportunity there too for um, currencies, um, like launch your own currency, maybe that's the future and maybe the asset exchange will not work out because it's so over-regulated. Or maybe it's like how Buzz says that you, we need to focus not on assets but on tokens so that we avoid that legal mess. Um, um, so, but yeah. Uh, um, so there are still different routes to follow and, and, and we will still have to see some of these routes that other people uh, are trying um, may, um, may work out. But um, yeah, something also very important why, why I start selling NXT is of course the license situation. 
still have to check what uh, Bas uh, said on my previous video. He, he made a, a reply, but I think the license is really not uh, well done um, in NXT. The, 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 so the GPL means that you can um, sell um, the NXT software privately. But who owns the NXT software? It's not the coin holders. It's not even NXT Foundation who, by the way, coin holders also don't have a um, ownership in. But it's also not. It's just it's just the 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 the, the, the programmers the, that have still the copyright, and and um, and so when they sell a private license, that money is going to the programmers. That's just really not acceptable. Um, I don't understand uh, how, how this is possible. Uh, that's also like partly my fault, fault when, because when it was happening half a year ago, they changed license. I was asleep at the wheel, but um, I'm waking up and, uh, and, and th th this does not make sense to me. The, 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 the copyright of the, of the, of the, of the, of the, of the, of, of NXT software should be with the coin holders who are the shareholders of the company if you can call it a company but it's a currency but the shareholders are the coin holders and no one else they are the owners and but at the same time i understand that if programmers are not compensated uh, that they want to keep the, the the ownership of the code um as, a, as they are basically donating the code to uh, the community but um but but that's just not well 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 done. Eh? Um, it should be arranged legally that uh, that uh, that um, uh, that the, uh, properly, of course, that the code is owned and and so the coin holders should pay the programmers for their work and in exchange the copyright goes to the coin holders eh? and that's how it should be legally. Um, I, this is the first time I talk about this, but. Uh, yeah, uh, I don't know if Jean-Luc and, 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 and others are open to talk about this, but I think it's very important to clear out. Um, um, yeah. Yeah. Is there anything else that's important? Um, I'm thinking. I can't come up with anything right now. So yeah, um, uh, why invest in self for one one is uh, because the same reason I invest in crypto. It's a, it's a disruptive uh, technology. Um, um, the state is um, a big problem in our society. Um, they monopolize um, industries um, under the threat of violence and uh, they offer shitty services for the most part or when they are good services they are extremely expensive but the cost is hidden as it goes via the taxes who are then very high but um so 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 the problem is that even though you have high taxes often the services they offer suck the money that they offer the euro here sucks goes down in value so rapidly um, um so 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 um but police services or um police or fire department or um um hospitals or schools all these organizations that are organized by the state um they suck huh? um and um and so it's really, if you can offer something competitive against it, uh, that is not oppressed, eh, because you can't start your own police station, uh, but um, you can do start your own security firm, uh, but of course you can do a lot, Yeah, you can't uh, treat people the way police treats people, um, but that's the future, that security is done by companies and not by government. And, um, and so this app uh, is a part of that, uh, that people help each other uh, and are uh, helped better by private companies than by the police. 
Well, I hope it works out because it's a high risk investment, of course. Uh, but I have uh, good trust in Virgil. Uh, he has the right philosophy and uh, and um, drive, and um, he has the results. The app is growing rapidly, and so that's really great to see. And so, um, yeah, it looks like he's actually going to sell his NXT first, and then his Bitcoin, but uh, probably only at the rate that um, that uh, he needs cash, which is about five to ten thousand dollars per month, probably. Um, so yeah. That's it. See ya. Bye.